What's up guys? Cisco is having me leave my house and go to the office. And I'm taking you guys with me. You need to see what's so important that I have to leave the safety of my house and be there. Just gonna quickly pack my laptop and get on my scooter. Just need to be safe. Who said that safety masks cannot be a fashion statement? This is our dining room. We have our fridges there with all of the drinks and hot plate and you know all of that behind there is our kitchen. But right now this has been turned into a 3D printing facility. actually face shields face shields for NHS that Cisco is going to give away for the NHS workers and that guy over there this guy Hello. he's the reason for all of this mess what's going on um, we are printing a ton of uh, face shields for medical workers in the NHS uh, it's become a little bit crazy, like I thought this would be like a relatively easy thing to set up, but it is not. Uh, we have 30 very uh, cheap 3D printers. Um, they are <laughs> breaking all the time. We're having to fight to keep them alive, but it's, um, it's a ton of fun. A target is about 350 per day. We can get that, yeah. and we'll get 10,000 face shields in four weeks, um, which would be an amazing goal to reach. Uh, Quarterly essentially, and there's people doing this in almost every country. Our colleagues in Reading uh, are doing this out of their office, we have people in the US, uh, people in Australia that are working through this, so it's, it's really, really cool to be part of it. Awesome, thanks. <laughs> so this is what we're making, it's a kit with a, uh, a frame, a piece of elastic, a uh, foam piece of foam padding that fits around the inside of the, uh, the plastic frame here, and uh, a clear visor, you can just see there, the holes punched. 